What is up guys, welcome back to the channel. It's Coach Nick here, owner of Worked Method Training and Nutrition. And today I'm coming at you with a 20 minute kettlebell and ab workout. All you need is a single kettlebell here with the option to upgrade to two if you have them. And we're gonna be doing some full body exercises as well as some core work. 20 minute EMOM style, so every minute on the minute you have a dedicated exercise and a dedicated number of reps. Your only rest is the remainder of the minute after you finish the reps in each exercise. Also, if you wanna try out the worked method, we have a 14 day free trial. You can sign up at the link down below, get access to our most recent dumbbell home training program and a bunch of other nutrition sources. Head to the link down below and sign up totally for free. Let's jump into the workout, guys. I'm gonna run us real quick through the five exercises we're gonna be doing, but you can always check out this preview window in the top right corner to see what exercise is coming up next. In the first minute, we are doing a two-handed kettlebell clean to squat. Setting up kettlebell in between your legs, keep your chest vertical, you're gonna pull, catch, that's the two-handed clean, and then we go into a full squat, reset back down at the center. Again, up, pull, catch, full squat, 10 reps in the first minute. Then we're gonna drop onto our back, and we are doing 10 kettlebell sit-ups. So dumbbells on your chest, Knees are bent, you're gonna sit up fully, nice and slow back down. You can hook your feet under some dumbbells if you need some leverage and you find your feet coming up off the floor too easily. From there, we're going a front rack kettlebell reverse lunge to press. You're gonna load up right arm, we're gonna keep the right leg forward, go back, let that knee kiss the ground, drive up, press overhead. Reset, 10 reps total. Then we're on our back again for another core exercise. We're gonna hold kettlebell like so. A little bit back over your head, your feet are off the ground, you're gonna bring both knees in and then straight back out. Trying to keep, the further you keep the kettlebell back over your head, the harder the exercise is. You can do that body weight if you struggle with holding a kettlebell overhead. And the final movement, you guessed it, is the reverse lunge and press on the left arm. 10 reps of everything. We're going five rounds through for 20 minutes. Let's jump right into it. We got a 10 second countdown, and we're starting off with those 10 kettlebell clean two squats. In five, three, two, one. Chest nice and vertical, pull, catch. Elbows in tight, nice and slow down. Try to drive through the heels, keep your chest vertical. Twenty seconds. Finish your ten reps. Rest the remainder of the minute. 12 seconds team, we're going kettlebell. Weighted sit-ups. I'm actually gonna leverage myself with some dumbbells under my toes. In three, one, and work. Set up, kettlebell on the chest. Full sit-up, nice and slow down. Let your head go all the way back. Let those abs extend and then crunch. Once you're done with the 10 reps, rest the remainder of the minute, hop up, walk it off. Nice deep breaths. We're gonna rack the right arm now, go right leg forward, reverse lunge with a press at the top. 10 reps in eight seconds, team. You can clean that kettlebell up to the shoulder to get started. In three, two, one, pop. Wrists nice and straight, core tight, up, press, reset. 10 reps.
30 seconds. Fifteen seconds, team. We're going kettlebell hold overhead with a double knee crunch on your back. In three, two, one. Legs off the floor. Squeeze all the way out. Extend those legs. Try to keep that low back flat against the ground. Ten reps. Twenty seconds, team. Throw a kettlebell in the left arm. Reverse lunge to press. Ten reps, left arm, left leg doing the lunge. In five, three, two, one, clean it. Abs tight, back, press. This is a nice kind of all around. Full body workout, core, quick and easy, in and out in 20 minutes. Exhale at the top. Just for reference, I'm going 45 on the clean to squat. I'm going 35 on the reverse lunge to press. Six seconds, team, we are back to the top. Two-handed kettlebell clean to squats, 10 reps. Work, catch, elbows in tight, squat, reset. Abs tight the whole time. Reset. Kettlebell weighted sit ups. In five, ten reps. Two, one, and work. You can also hook your feet under a couch a ledge, anything you have for some leverage if you need it. Make sure you fully extend that spine to the bottom. Back, crunch. Kettlebell reverse lunge the press, right arm. You want to rack that kettlebell right in the crease of your arm. You want that wrist nice and straight, punching straight up through. Two, right arm, right leg. Slow descent, drive, lock out, bicep near your ear in a straight line, bring it back down into that rack position. Fish should be near your chin.
down back. We're splitting up the thrusters with that kettlebell overhead double leg reach. Double leg uh, tuck. Two, one, 10 reps. Take the arch out of your lower back. Legs off the ground, pull. Pull back out. Pull, extend those legs. Elbows locked out. Dumbbell slightly behind your head. Set it down, sit up. Thruster and presses on the left arm. And we are halfway through the workout. This is a nice opportunity after this one to ask yourself how the weight's feeling. Increase the weight if it's feeling a little easy. If you find yourself cheating on your form, decrease the weight a bit. I'm also gonna be the option to increase the reps by two. And work. So after this round, if everything's feeling good, we can bump up two reps on everything. Only if your form feels super solid and you're moving pretty well through all of it. We're always looking for quality over quantity. Back to the top. I'm gonna to keep the same weight on my clean to squat. I'm gonna bump it up to 12 reps though. It's gonna be a quick turnaround on this one. This is a little longer exercise cycle. And work. Clean, squat, reset. 12 reps. Remember to breathe. Reset, kettlebell crunch, uh, sit ups. One, bump up a 12 if you got some juice. Let's get it, team. This is where we make progress. These EMOMs, they start out a little easy and get harder as we go. Limited rest. Try to give me 12 if you can. Feels good. Nice little sweat. Sometimes all you need is 20 minutes. One. And work. Clean it up. All right. Let that knee kiss. Find your knee bouncing, slow it down. Twenty seconds. Come on. <sighs> 
10 second seam. Overhead, re overhead kettlebell hold with that double knee crunch. 12 reps. One. And work. Further overhead if you want to make it harder. Ooh. 25 team. 12 lunges and presses on that left arm. Come on. We get this left arm and then we got one round through. Really try to push the envelope here a little bit. But that shorter time work, time frame, intensity needs to increase a little bit. So challenge yourself. In five, two, one, left arm, reverse lunge, press. If you want to get results out of shorter workouts, you can increase the intensity of it. So we don't want to just breeze through this. Always keeping quality of reps at top of mind, though. Second, final round through. Cleans with the squats. One, 10 or 12 reps. Let's get it. Pull, explode, catch, squat. Reset. Explode, catch. Kettlebell, be close to the body as you pull. Eight seconds. I'm gonna increase the weight of my kettlebell sit up. 45. Two, one, and work. The core muscle is just like any other muscle. You gotta provide a stimulus for it to grow and get stronger. First lunge to press. I'm gonna try to go 45s here too. Forget it. If I gotta cut the reps down, that's fine. Back to 10. Or if I need to drop the weight back down, I'm fine with that. In three, one, and work. Right on. Ooh, that was 
fun. 10 seconds. We got those overhead holds with leg reaches. Two, one, and work. 12 reps. Keep those elbows locked out. Keep the tension on the core the whole time. Final exercise of the circuit. Left arm, reverse lunge, the press. Come on. Try to get 12 on me if you can. Let's get it. In five, you got the full minute. Two, one, and work. Clean, catch, left leg. done team awesome work give yourself a round of applause for finishing that kettlebell and ab workouts if you guys enjoy that workout please give it a thumbs up subscribe to the channel so i know what content to keep bringing you guys every week i'm releasing some type of kettlebell workout ab workout uh, i'm releasing a full body dumbbell program another one of the worked method older programs the tempo program on monday so make sure you check that out if you want a full four week training program or if you want access to our most recent training program, the Buff program, you can sign up at the link down below. You get two weeks for free. You get full access to the website. Check it out. No, no credit card to sign up. Totally free. Thank you guys for joining in. I hope you enjoyed it. And I'll see you in the next workout. Thanks, guys.